Hello beautiful family I go by the name Good to the Widow first born of the elephant Mr Lingling way take to take but a man can try kiss be the weather ko to end mana sako so good morning good afternoon good evening to you depending with your time zone here it's afternoon here in Africa and uh, I thank God for the gift of life today as you can see I've started this video <laughs> where <laughs> but it's all right so beautiful family uh, today I just wanna travel out of the village for some few days then I will I will be back and uh, just wanna go visit uh, my mother you know my mother is usually a mother and much love to all the mothers out there all over the world so you know even if you are far away from home you are or far away due to your activities and sometimes we, we have to remember our mother uh, are you getting because mother is usually a mother and when we create that time to show up to visit them you know they also feel that love that my children usually remember me even if they are grown up they can still come and uh, show love so i'm going to check my mother out in the in the village there and i'm um, i'm now out of the village today and uh, the rest of my team i know we, we, we will we will reunite when i will be back so i'm gonna spend some quite um a yeah, few days um there in the village and uh, you just understand so where you see me i've started my video this way i stay this way i have been and this way i first rented the house as you can see maybe i might turn the camera so you check it out so stay tuned so you know the sun is up and this my place i want to give you a tour and the this a little this uh, kitchen garden it's only plantain as you can see it's only plantain grown here and also we have there av avocado also we have here papaya coming up you see this papaya tree coming up and also passion fruit this also passion fruit coming up so Oh, uh, this just a kitchen garden uh, for for the fruit. I know you have to understand. So the only growers are the this uh, pl plantains, and it has been uh, harvested here several times where, while I'm still there. Also, as you can see, this one was already harvested, and also also this one was already harvested, and there is. The other one, this one there, this one there. So the kitchen garden has been doing good there. And also if you can see the little ones coming. So by the time these bigger ones will be ready, this one will be upcoming. So that's how a continuous growth of a plantain. Yes, of a, is this a banana plant or what? No idea. So this is my place, this is where I come from, and as you can see, out there, Nyabuanze is behind this wall, somewhere here, just uh, 50 meter, meters from where I'm staying is Nyabuanze Market, and almost 100 meters, it's Nyabuanze Center up there. So, this is my place, this is where... I, uh, I have been living, I know I've never shot a video in this place and these are our washroom, don't, don't mind and as you can see, this is my place me I rented here, this is my place and there is this neighbor who migrated the other day uh, okay, so you understand So and uh, this here is maize eh? it's maize you know when you are going to visit your mother you cannot go bare hands so i have carried uh, 
maize here the mother will use and also a, a packet of rice oh there is this boy here throwing thing this this my body here so these are grandson to my landlady who is doing some washing there okay just a minute so to what this eh? this also a bag of, of rice this one a bag of rice for maize this one is gonna be enough for my mother and one two three that i might add uh, on the way so without further ado maybe i can go here we greet my landlady if she don't mind me yeah, what Mm -hmm. So familiar out there, this has been my landlady. For the first time when I came in Nyabuanze here, I came like with uh, a thousand shillings if I mind. I didn't have anything and God connected me with my landlady here. And when I was looking for a place to rent, uh, it was a coincidence that I have one K and also the cube that she gave me also one thousand and that's how i came to start living here and she is a, a, a prayerful woman she accepted me as one of uh, of her son and also oh, i came without anything i only have a bag with some few clothes and he also, uh, she also gave me a mattress she also gave me yeah, a mattress and a blanket just to lay my head and without going uh, and toward more she also came through and give me food just imagine I, I don't have anything she fed me that day and what I did I just knelt down in my house there and prayed God God thank you I'm seeing you I'm seeing you through. You have walked with me and I'm seeing you through. Eh? Are you getting? So this kind of love out there, family, we should be showing to one another. So from that day, she has been feeding me. I'm a stranger to her, but she accepted me as one of her son. And also, oh, also there is a lady living here. Now, uh -huh. with this lady, they have been feeding me here like their son. But, you know, not all, though, not everything you can put through the camera. So today, I'm traveling, traveling to visit my mother in the village. And I feel like to bring her if she can greet you. <laughs> <laughs> I just say hi, hi to my family out there. Hi. Yes, greeting. So she is my lovely landlady here and also her grandson who is very, my, my buddy and very stubborn. <laughs> you see uh, that cheeky boy. <laughs> yes, so the landlady stays here and also she is doing uh, washing some utensils here. And uh, today, so landlady, I'm traveling back home to visit my mother and then uh, I will be back in a few days God willing so thank you also that nice one <laughs> you see nice I don't want to lie you see that sack there of me she's the one who gave me to take to my mother yes when I bought the rice that you have seen so she has been a good lady here just pray for her as she always pray for you out there. Asante sana. Mwa so asante kwa kunikaribisha kama kijana wako na au nijui. Eh. Sema tu hata kwa Kiswahili usiogope. Kama unataka kuongea kikorea. Ongea kikorea. Eh. Eh. Na ni sawa. Kwa ni kijana Oh. Wewe uwezi jua maybe mimi ni kijana mwingine mkora najifichanga tu jagundua tu eh wewe utajuaje ati hakuna eh umejua tu wanajifichanga unaweza kuwa umeniona hivi kumbe ni kitu kingine tu 
<laughs> so family just stay tuned as we travel then and the rest I will bring you clear footing stay tuned for now <laughs> so beautiful family I'm here on the road I'm waiting for a vehicle uh, that's going direct to the Umabe County it's the same road to Kisumu and also my own village you know it's there in uh, Nyakach and I'm waiting for a vehicle here to board to board one vehicle so I'm on the road and also as you can see this is the main road I see where I put my bag there this is the main road this side and uh, as you can see this side Nyabuanze is somewhere there Nyabuanze is up there so I came to this side because it's hot as you can see the sun there yes it's very hot today and the, the sky is not that clear but the rains are the, the, there is rains around so I'm saying bye bye for the village for now until we meet again so you just stay tuned as we travel together peace be with you Nyabuanze is there and that is Nyabuanze this is the international highway as you can see my luggage is there yes my luggage is this side as I'm waiting to to board a vehicle so this is the thing and also you know it's very sunny but also I see the weather is taking it's now, now wanna tr take its place and I'm I'm right in this ditch here oh no this is not a ditch this is a drainage you see this is a, a road drainage within the reserve here yes so you stay stay tuned as we travel together now one day is there where you see these people let me zoom in there is Nyabuanze. So beautiful family, I hope you are good depending with the, uh, where you are with your family. So me I came back to my own village. I traveled yesterday and I reached 
I reached here in the evening. It was late around 8 p.m. So I could not make it to to finish my video and uh, that's why also I did not upload it. yesterday. I did not upload. So today it's a good day. Now the sun has gone down here. That's why I decided now how to shoot. Now to up, update the family there. So me I travel from from the village in Yabuanze and came here to my village to visit my mother who is here in the village. You know, uh, as kids we, we have to love our parents and sometimes it's a good creating time to visit our parents. Whether whether we are grown-ups or, or uh, like uh, let me say, you know in Africa, uh, mostly here in Africa, um, me, my mom is not that old, but mostly here in Africa, you see, uh, we live like with the, with, with the old, you see the old, like the grannies or what, we live to them. In Africa, here, more so Kenya, I don't know the other side, there is no, there is nothing like we, the way we see out there, uh, in the first countries where you see now the old are being taken to the uh, to the elderly homes in africa no in africa we live with them to show them love the way they showed us love when when they brought us when they started uh, uh, the family the love they show us so also it's a love we have to show them are you getting we have to show the love for our elderly that's why we usually stay with all our elderly. So, well, here uh, things are a bit different with with the way you do uh, with the with your system out there. So, here we have to live with our old. We have to be, you know, you know, old age is like uh, it's a um, uh, endangered age. So. Oh, they, they, they usually are want to be loved, to be there for them. Uh, are you getting? For them to also experience life, like they are not alone now in their old ages. So I'm um, just embracing out there, you can show love for your elderly. Yes, let's show love take care of them even out there if you take them to the elderly homes you can also try to give them a visitation yes for them to show that you still remember them you still love them you still think about them are you getting so that, that one i was just talking about the whole and right now me i came to visit my mother here in the village to see how she is doing and yes also to see that uh, yes children out there who care about her you know if we go missing out there without remembering your parents more so like now me i have a, a mother my mother she's a widow yes so we have to show them to show her love as as the children she brought up in a good way. Are you getting? So we have to be there. Even if sometimes we, we, we fight the sides of life out there, still we think about them, we come, uh, we create time, we come, we talk with them, we chat. Oh, that's a plane. I don't know if you will see it. Are you seeing that plane up there? Yes, that's a plane. So it's good to create like that time. Uh, come, usually, yes, come give a visitation. We usually talk in the, we usually talk through phone sometimes, but it's good also physically. That's why I take a, a, a break of a few days to come here. Yes, to show love for my mother and also 
uh, my brother who is not around my my brother who seconds me who is not around and the younger brother is in the city so when i will visit the city before i go back to to nyabo then i will yes you will come to know him also so that's how he is it and you remember the last time me making video here uh, the kitchen garden where the I was preparing a kitchen garden for my mother to get used to kitchen garden that can help her in with, with some veggies to use real yeah, like that's common common veggies to use I know you remember so the uh, the kitchen garden started with the the little one that uh, I show you if you remember that video I did here in the village you will see today it's a very big transformation maybe just a minute let me turn the camera to show you to give you the out update yes this one let me start with the, the the little one that was here that you remember um the other the other time i came in the village oh. so these are some of the chicken the mother keeps here they are two of them so look at if you can remember if you can remember this mm, kitchen garden when this peanuts was a little bit big the tomatoes were still young yes the tomatoes were still young by then so look at look at the transformation mission hmm? this has been helping the mother here if you want some uh, veggies yeah she can get it here that's why i usually em embrace the issue of uh, kitchen garden even if you have a small space out there you can make your kitchen garden or you can make that multi-story the one that is in step they call multi-story garden yes you can make that multi-story garden put some veggies so Look how now spinach are smiling here. You see how spinach are good here. So my mother is enjoying this. And also the colored green, you see. See how the colored green here is fresh. Yeah. Fresh and good. So this one is a pipe pear tree. The one you see here. So the last video I did here. Even these tomatoes. They were still young, as you can see. But they tried, they tried, you know, so my mother cannot go missing things like tomato. She gets them here in this garden, as you can see. Things like tomato, my mother gets them here in the garden. See how the colored green looks like. Hmm? See how the colored green is looking like? very fresh you see so at least this has been keeping my mother going so maybe she can budget a few things so these were the, the tomatoes as you can see them a lot has been uh, harvested out of this tomato a lot has been harvested you see a lot has been harvested. but also uh, they told me the other day there was a heavy rain. So this heavy rain was like like damages. So this little kitchen garden here was flooded with water. It was flooded and also there are some predators. That's where you see some part. Look at this just a small kitchen garden here. Yeah. Also you see some parasite. These are birds. You see, and these activity are birds. The birds also destroying them. But it's good. Mother's mother see this kitchen garden was a a very good idea. This one was started with my my brother who is here in the village. He was the one who started this. And you can see the outcome. If you go check out the video I did the last one when these tomatoes were still in their young age when they were planted 
you will see a very big transformation different with the the way you see these ones right now so also these tomato the mother has harvested a lot of them because birds are destroying them the way you see you see this one this is birds yes the birds has been coming to destroy them so she protected the ones which have matured the ready ones where she already harvested them let me and the breed is good even if you look this this one hmm? look at how the fruits are far farm the fruits are big yeah let me go check out the one yeah uh, she are harvested it's evening here yeah the time has already gone oh nyakenya you are inside yeah oh it's dark yeah it's it's dark it's very dark you see it's already evening so if you can remember these are the ones my mother have harvested from that small kitchen garden you see see this one has already ripe others are still not yet you see you see how good our kitchen garden is so you see this this one for personal use is like bumper vest for my mother she has, now anytime she doing a cooking activity there is tomato there is veggies and also why we should look for the onion seed seeds for the own things like onions yes to put there so let's go check the bigger one so let's go check for the that one was that small kitchen garden you see it right there this one the small one here yeah, and also this one was the bigger one the one i was preparing the other time by slashing around here so the seeds did not do that well the way you see them they have scattered but we're gonna replace them with the new seedlings so it's also you see it's good we cannot complain but uh, we love to go look for the uh, to buy other seedlings to replace them also as you can see this place is secured eh? against like uh, uh, there is cattle here uh, there is goats here there is sheep here so this to protect them from being eaten or destroyed away also as you can see hmm. oh this one this one is not watermelon this one is a pumpkin this one this one is pumpkin you see it here but i know if we replace those seedlings or uh, those seedlings there it will it will do well the way the other one has done well also we have here called, uh, this one is called water tree hmm. why am i forgetting moringa this is a moringa you see moringa is also some sort of Abol. also you remember the like okra oh there is also a, a banana plant coming so this pumping pumpkin has overlapped from there to this side you see it's look like they are of, they are different breed maybe so you see this also you know here in africa the leaves these leaves of pumping pumpkin are also being being eaten they are very delicious and they are like they are like slippery like okra you see how the okra is very slippery this pumpkin leaf is also more more the same like that also there is okra here oh, look here 
uh, banana seed coming hey i'm regretting i forgot to bring i should have bring some some bananas to plant so you see this this is where okra come from this veggies is very very sweet together with the okra they are very very and also you see a lot of aloe veras there is a lot of aloe veras here so without uh, further ado um let's go maybe it's time you can greet my mother she is a uh, she's around you can can I greet my mother? Yes, Nya Kenya. Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm fine. Feeling good? Not so bad. Yes. Mm. The cold. You feel cold or what? I feel cold. Okay. Mm. So family, this is my mother here. The one who brought up the elephant and the other two guys who are not around. Oh, okay, mom, you can greet them. Hi. Yes. My name is Teresa Chien. Yeah. But I thank God for today. It's a wonderful day. It's evening now. Yes. But we thank God because he healed me. Oh, you were sick? Mm, I was having malaria. Okay. I was sleeping good two weeks when I'm just in the bed. Oh, for hey, for but two. I thank God now I can do something small but not. Hmm. You are strong, eh? I'm strong, not very strong, but I'm just a bit strong. Yes. But I thank God because uh, the brother of the elephant <laughs> is the one who was cooking for me, doing for me everything. <laughs> I thank God for that. Oh, you the yeah. elephant also. Hmm. I was not around, but he was not around. But I thank hmm. God, God brought him yes he come to see me but we usually get in touch through the phone yeah, through the phone we are talking mm. through the phone i can uh, talk with him he can uh, ask mm. me how i'm going yeah, yes yeah but i thank god who brought him here to see me god yeah. bless him so much yeah no no problem uh, and you people here i thank god for helping my son god bless you so much with your family we thank God for that. Gutu is a good boy. He's a hard working. We thank God for that. Because God is everything. Mm. But I greet you people all. God bless you so much with your family. God is everything. We thank him. Yeah. He's the one who give us this day. We yeah. thank him for that. But uh, the boy who is sick. We are praying for him. God bless him. God heal him. Yes. Because as we don't have power to heal somebody, but if we pray, God is the one who is doing everything. Yeah, for sure. Um, so we put the hand of God to the son. We know God will do something one day. He will heal him. How he healed me. We yes. know God is the everything. So yes. we just pray for the boy. God knows the boy so much. Uh, the boy who is sick. The boy who is sick. Uh, you know, <laughs> the boy who is sick. Mm. Uh, we we put uh, his life go through the hands of our Almighty God. Mm. Uh, he is the one who can heal. Can our heal. life is in his hand, and also we we have to continue to pray for him, mm. and all shall be well. God will not let us down. Mm -mm. Yes. So I thank you people so much because you are supporting my son. You don't know him. He also he doesn't know you. But through God, yes. God is wonderful. And yeah. God can do something which we people we can't know or we can't do. So family, it's evening. Let's... <coughs> let's call it a day and you also i know some of you it's morning uh other places is noon and we this side it's evening so for the people who are still on the day have a good day for the people who are going on the night 
have a good night so remember to check my boss i am a yugno road to 50,000. also the entire crew check out nico underscore border also road to 5,000. check out ken underscore the remedy road to 5,000. check our lovely sister dorina underscore elisha road to 10,000. Dorina now is on the road to 10,000. Well, let me say all of us who are, we are in on the road to success. And uh, God bless you all, always, Team Marwa, Team Redeemer all over the world. God bless you with your entire family. Uh, more so, without to remember, our lovely mothers like Mama Redeka, Mama Grace, Patsy Richard, Sal Richard, I am King Explorer. That's the king and the wife. Uh, first guy, like the entire crew of the Redeemer family and the Marwa family. The list is to just to mention a few. You, you understand. So, with much love, I will be still here in the village for a few days then i will go to the city on our yes i will spend the weekend on the city also after visiting my mother uh, because also let's let's see how tomorrow will go maybe tomorrow oh okay tomorrow is on the it's on the hands of god but we usually live we live as we hope for tomorrow okay no problem me just we are with much love i love you out there more so always depending with that where you are watching us you can show love smile also let's put let's send the week with smile yes try to be happy try to be happy even if it's sad you can create sometimes be happy let's fight all these anxiety things the, that might bring us mental issues because we were built to live happy we were built to enjoy the goodness of this life yes as you know we are all in this journey of life. We are all here. We are all passing. Are you getting? We are on the walk. So, try to be happy for all our fans out there who, don't, who are down, maybe sick, something like that. Try Just trust God. I want to put you also in my prayers as you pray. I always say God to remember you through your difficulties more so your sickness. No sickness is not something that, that is planned. These are techniques of the enemy. And through our God, we through our God trusting and believing, having faith, our God wash them away. And we have still have to stay strong. Still, we have to bond in our God. With, with, without looking the rough waters, we are going or you are going. Yes. For all anybody who is very sick right now, who is under the bed, maybe in the hospital, depending on the ones who are in the house, whichever the place. May God see you through your difficult moment of illness. And I pray, Almighty God, remember more so how a team out there who are, might not be going uh, through, who, who is going through, through difficulties of illness, God, just remember them. You are the healer. Just raise my Father, my God, through the authorities of Jesus Christ. Just raise your healing hand to all our family 
wherever they are to get healed. Remember, I'm always with you. So, don't feel you are alone. We are together. There is a few I could um, mention their names here. Maybe, you know. Yes, due to privacy. You know me, I like consulting before putting everything. Yes, true. Because you may say, oh, when do put in prayer, maybe it will have not sound good. So, recount me on that I'm with you also as a brother, as a son to you. I'm with you with your, uh, during this rough time of yours. So, don't give up. Just hold on, knowing there is God up there. We hear our prayers. And he will see you through. And our God never disappoints. And I know he will not disappoint us during uh, such moments. Also, the team redeemer team are out there and all the people who come through who are not among the team. Much blessing, much love to you. God bless you for always showing up to watch my videos full full. For always leaving a good comment. For always having that moment we chat through the premiere. And also to all of you, Team Redeemer, Team Marwa and others. Anybody or the people who are born today. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you wherever you are. All the people who are born today. I felt like today I just uh, wish you a happy birthday. Anybody who is, who is remembering the, the date of um, the date of birth today. For anybody who is born today, wishing you a happy birthday. Just from my heart to wish you. Me, I'm, I'm a born October. Yes. Me, I'm a born October. Me, I'm a October 22nd. Yes. I will, the elephant was brought in October 22nd. But wishing you all there happy birthday. The people who are born today. God bless you. God bless you. So, praying for the peace of the world. Peace be with the world. Peace be with your families. Peace be with us. Pray for me and my family as we also pray for you and the team Redeemer. Peace.